Hey guys, how's it going? This is SKS45 with another video. Uh, today we're going to do part two of why buying the SKS. Well, if you're watching this video, congratulations. You survived the Great Gun Panic of 2013. Never before have we seen such sweeping legis legislation that actually just made a complete panic and scare of firearms and firearms related material. Ammo went up. Um, ammo actually skyrocketed. All types of rifles, anything from bolt action to semi-autos, semi-autos skyrocketed. Uh, this was a big one. Luckily, on the federal level, nothing got passed that would actually prevent uh, actually owning an SKS. Um, all right. Anyway, so um, so you survived the Great Gun Panic, and you're thinking about getting into the firearms now that the whole rush has kind of died down. Well, believe it or not, after all the crazy stuff that happened, the SKS is still here, and it's here to stay. Right now, pa post-panic prices are about $299 to $319, give or take. Um, this one is actually a Chinese commercial, so I paid about $350. Um, yes, there are other mores like Russians, Romanian stuff that got more. But if you're just looking for a very, very simple SKS, plain Jane, Chinese SKS is the way to go. Um, ironically, the SKS is still cheap to shoot. Uh, right now, the current uh, prices on 762 by 39 is 24 cents a round, and that's from uh, Gunbroker. Um, as you can see here, I have some of the very rare now Yuko Surplus M67. Since the gun panic, this stuff has dried up, and I believe um, it's about 55 cents a round because it's no longer being imported, and this stuff just got eaten up during the gun panic. But for the regular stuff like Tula, Wolf, um, and all the steel stuff to go plinking with, it's about 24 cents a round, which is still pretty cheap. And uh, believe it or not, that's actually pre-panic prices. Um, okay, now with the physical rifle here, um, even though there wasn't anything passed on a federal level, a lot of states like California, Colorado, New York, all those blue states pass their own gun version or their own gun laws and such. The great thing about owning an SKS is that it basically bypasses all those laws. All right, with that being said, the laws basically don't hurt the SKS. Uh, the reason being is because we have a fixed stock. Uh, we have actually a fixed magazine, so it's not detachable like an AK and AR-15. Also, it doesn't have a pistol grip. It actually has the old school wooden grip. And the, also, just one of the amazing things, it doesn't have um, you know, uh, a, a lever. Uh, we're not talking about safety lever, we're talking about an actual, well, the safety off lever type of deal. Some states like California make that a big deal. So, and also in most places, having a bayonet is actually perfectly legal. So that's why the SKS is just a perfect weapon for the post panic, especially if you're just getting into firearms. One of the things we saw during the panic is a lot of new guys were spending all this money on new ARs and AKs and they had no idea what to do with them. And you know, as simple as those weapons are, if you're a complete new guy and you're just jumping in on the bandwagon, you're going to have a lot of trouble running and operating the AR-15. With the SKS, you don't need to do that. Very simple, just 10 rounds on stripper clips here and the sights are pretty basic and you can just go off and blast away. Um, also accessories for the SKS are still really readily available. We got some, um, I got the Chinese bandolier here, you get these for about 15 bucks. Got the Chinese sling that came with the rifle. Also if you want to read about it, um, you can get the SKS 45 collector's book by Steve Kaya and Joe Poyer. That actually is very helpful for new guys. That gives you everything about all the SKS's as well. So like I said, this is an excellent rifle for shooters because of the gun panic. Um, availability, availability, yeah, excuse me. The availability of these rifles is very high. Uh, just recently, there's been a huge shipment of Chinese SKS um, that are actually more of the Russian, Romanian-looking types, as they're their first early years of production. So it's going to have the full blade. It'll have the full stock, and everything's all mill parts. Uh, you can get those at Classic Arms, Century Arms, JNG Sales. And if you have a CNR FFL license, you can get that shipped straight to your house. And like I said, those usually come about 299 to 319 bucks. So, alrighty guys, well just, just an update on the SKS. If you see one in your local pawn shop, grab it. Um, these are excellent rifles. They're very, very abundant now. 
and even during a gun panic these are just great rifles to have and even if you don't shoot a lot it's good to put in your safe because one day these will dry up just like the Mausers and just like Mosin's will one day and these will be worth some money plus these are excellent for hunting you can go out the desert plinking you don't have to worry about all the crazy laws with detachable mag magazines and select fire levers and all that other crap so alrighty guys well this is SKS or 45 uh, just checking in with you and hope you guys are staying safe. Uh, congratulations again for surviving the gun panic and I hope to see you out there on the range. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs>